one tiny piece of evidence may matter most in the state's case against Joshua Rosa. You heard us just talking about it now. The nail clippers and his defense team wants any evidence tied to those clippers tossed. Now, most folks covering the story are making it sound like the defense is trying to pull something, but they aren't. Brian Gonzalez and Kathleen Lazara are simply demanding prosecutors do something they are not typically forced to do follow the law, which in Florida required police to return his belongings, clippers and all, to Joshua Rosa unless they had probable cause to suspect him of murder, which they did not. But in our law and order culture, being tough on crime trumps the rule of law. So while you're watching the Joshua Rosa case, think about this. Do you want to live in an America based on laws or one based on the current political climate, which can change with the wind? It may be Joshua Rosa on trial today, but it just may be you tomorrow. And that's the last word.